In this video I'm gonna be performing the song Spheres of Madness. It's uh, probably their most famous song or one of their most popular songs that they play like every time. Without any further ado, let's just watch it and then we're gonna go step by step through certain parts and we're gonna be uh, dissecting and examining some technical aspects as well as musical aspects just like we did uh, last time with Belfagor. So, let's watch it, enjoy! A couple of things before I start going into details part by part. Something that you need to really know about this band is uh, I remember when I first had to rehearse with them, uh, I, I've been giving a clear picture of the whole, uh, like the way they, they are uh, doing stuff, they're playing, and they said, God, uh, Eugene, we know that you play in Balfour, we don't really care about speed, technique, and all that stuff, it doesn't really matter here. What we need is groove and feeling and fire and all that stuff. And I was like, yeah, of course. I mean, I got the technique. How tough is it? Can it be to do, you know, the, the other stuff? But it turned out to be the hardest thing ever that I've done in my life. They pointed out what is uh, considered to be not a mistake, but stuff that I should try to avoid. I'm used to play fast stuff. So, and I'm, and I'm always this guy, when, especially when it comes to snare, I just... I just hit and then I and then I lift my hand like this because I'm ready to do the next hit if I'm playing fast stuff. When it comes to playing this slow groovy music with the, this dragged snare, they want you to do this. Like bury the stick into the snare drum, which is something I don't do absolutely at all. And uh, this also kind of it's a lot about feeling here, which is hard to explain. Although this is Drum Technique Academy, right now this is a Drum Feeling Academy, okay? So, they want you to, and this kind of burying the, the stick into the snare kind of gives you a lot of weight into that hit. Something like this. It's hard to explain. Uh, hopefully, who knows, maybe Vogue is gonna be here in the, in the academy, he could explain this better because there's a lot of things that, that you just learn how to feel uh, thanks to rehearsing and jamming with other musicians. Ah, huh? there, you saw it? I play like pss, 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 and then I do the accents on the crashes and then I, I just spin, I grab this, the, the hi-hat with my fingers and I just like push it away so it like turns away. But there's round two because I continue hitting the hi-hat and then it turns back again, it wants revenge. <laughs> 